Welcome back to the channel, fellow subnauticists. My name is Jamison, and this is one of the places you can get your hands on the coffee machine in Below Zero. Let's get on with the video. As per usual guys, we're going to start off here at Iceberg Island, which is conveniently situated between our true zero point to the east, and our many potential spawn locations to the west. Those are its coordinates for anyone who wants to use console commands. But once here at Iceberg Island, we're going to hop in our sea truck. Once in our sea truck, we're going to proceed to head directly south for about 700 metres. Now for this journey, all we'll need is our scanner and sea truck as the coffee machine is located at the entrance to the Delta Islands. You can do this with a sea glide if you'd like, but eh, it's not really worth it. So, bare minimums for this video guys, a sea truck and a scanner. However, if you want to explore the islands once you're there, take additional resources with you such as food, water, things to keep you warm, etc, etc. Now as for hostile fauna and flora guys, you only have one thing to worry about and that's our shark alligator friends in the vented areas or the thermal spires, but if you're in a sea truck and you don't bother them, they won't bother you. So it's essentially just a straight line for 700 meters with no apparent dangers. As you can see, there's our shark crocodile thingy friend over there. I really need to learn what they're called. But we just keep heading straight. You'll be awfully close to the surface, which is why you can do it in a sea glide, or with a sea glide, I should say. But as you can see, we're running out of ocean, and now the little fenders or buoys have come into view. We're gonna pull up here, I always choose the left side, and hop out of our sea truck. Once out of our sea truck, you're gonna wanna go right up the stairs here, straight to the main platform, and sitting on a desk is our coffee vending machine. You only need to scan the one fragment to unlock its recipes, and just like that, you're done. You can now make a coffee machine in your base with the habitat builder and use that thermos of coffee to warm yourself up when exploring above ground or rather above water. With that being said guys, I think it's time to conclude today's video. So if you liked it, like it. If you didn't like it, by all means dislike it. And if you'd like to leave some feedback on this video or give me some suggestions for future ones or hell you just want to say good day. Drop me a comment down below, I do like hearing from you all. And if you'd really like to help myself and the channel out, please don't be a stranger, consider hitting that subscribe button, and or checking out some of the other content up on the channel. Once again, my name is Jamison, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye for now.